So I love the fact that you guys take a lot of the heavy lifting off of this process for me. I know every Thursday at three o'clock, I'm gonna have people to talk to. I love that once that's over, you know, you guys are going to do the heavy lifting in terms of setting up the next day, uh, telling the people that we like, hey, let's get this thing going, or hey, you know what, it's not gonna make sense this time around. Um, I love the fact that you guys do that initial phone screen. I think ultimately to have one person to have the agency owner myself to do the phone screen to do the group interview to do the whole thing um i think it takes a lot of allure away from the fact that people get to talk to me and then they have the one-to-one -one. i think that makes the one-to-one -one more special that i didn't do everything from start to finish so to have you guys do that is uh really really helpful i think for me and for anybody We had two hires in the summertime, um, and we've made we've made probably another three offers uh, through you guys. So ultimately, you know whether or not people stick around or they're they're great at what they do it has nothing to do with you guys. The most important thing is that you put people in front of me that we feel confident we can make an offer to, and you know that's what we've done. So we've gotten the results that we were told we would get. You know, it's it's interesting because I think for the I think for the right person, it uh, it does a lot. What I love about it is it makes it easy for people to jump on, right? So I've tried to do quote unquote group interviews before, where people came into the office, and then you know I've sat here at six thirty at night, and there's nobody here, and I'm waiting for somebody to show up, and I've wasted my Tuesday night, and that stinks. You know, virtual group interviews, you know somebody's gonna be there. You don't have to wait around. Like that's 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 awesome. There's always a flip side to things. I think there's some people who you know, you know look at it and they kind of feel like they're in the hunger games and they've gotta, you know, compete. But you know, maybe those aren't really the right people. But you know what? One of the things I love to do is I love I love to address that with them in the one-to-one -one interview. I'll literally ask them, like, hey, what'd you think about that format? And they're like, wow, it was different it was unique and I, I don't I don't know and it it makes for a really great iceberg because I mean look none of us I think want to do the things that you guys do you know as agents you know we're not paid to do phone screens to call people all day I mean look I told you today I called people right I called people that came through for free and just randomly got resumes to, you know, look, that's work that, you know, we shouldn't necessarily be doing. We should be coaching our teams. We should be, you know, developing processes. We should be closing business and meeting with policyholders, not reaching out to voicemails of people that, you know, may or may not actually fit this role. So the fact that you guys do that on the, on, on the front end is something that I think every agent or really business owner can, you know, take a lot of value from. And then also, I mean, the facilitating of the group interview can't be understated because I think an interview just in general is an awkward process for anybody, business owner and candidate. And to have that third party in there to say, hey, look, I'm gonna start this off. Okay, John, why don't you take it? And there's a format and there's a system. You know, I know for myself, I feel a lot more at ease uh, when I go through it. And the more of these I've done, the better I've felt. So that's why I would recommend it is because, you know, I don't think a lot of people really understand how valuable that um, that breakup between voices and that facilitation can really be.